quickly. Nuggets center Nikola Jokic stole the show at the Garden. He had a career-high 40 points. Do you view him as the most underrated player in the NBA? I mean, he, he's definitely close to it. This kid's been solid. He's been playing well all year. And, uh, you know, he's showing us something different every night. The good thing about it is he's on a team that's, that's, that, that's really under the radar. But he's, his play is, is showing why he, he, he definitely needs to be noticed. I think I think I think this kid is always going only going to get better, and if he can get in a better situation or get better guys around him, he probably could be an all star soon. You know what he reminds me of, Stephen? He reminds me of Sabonis a little bit. Like yeah. I, I know Arvidas younger younger Arvidas is more athletic, but Jokic's game is one of like a thirty six year old man. Like he's just really crafty. He's got a high basketball IQ. He shoots it pretty well. Uh, he needs to grow out his hair. His hair <laughs> is horrible. <laughs> Who's ever cutting his hair in Denver? He has a bad look. He's got to get in the sun once in a while. He's got to grow out his hair. But as far as his <laughs> basketball skills, he's so talented. He's not as athletic as Anthony Davis or Carl Anthony Towns or Porzingis. But he needs to start being included in that group because his basketball IQ and his smarts may be better than all those guys. He's going to have to be because he's not as athletic. Like Steven's right. He's someone who's got an extremely bright future. His coach loves him. Mike Malone said he wouldn't trade Jokic. For any other big man in the entire NBA, and now Mike Malone looks like one of the smartest guys in the 